the types of blood group in the human being there are four types of the blood group in the human being blood group a blood group b blood group ab and blood group o all these four type of blood group are decided by the presence of antigen on the surface of the rbc and antibody in the blood serum so out of that four type of blood group blood group a b and o were discovered by the karl lenstiner by the blood group ab was discovered by the lenstiner student de castillo and sturley all these four type of blood group are because of the antigen because of the respective antigen on their rbc surface and the antibody and the corresponding antibody in the in their blood serum uh, one more type of uh, antigen was discovered by the lenstiner with the wiener and the name of that uh, um, antigen is antigen d and uh, that antigen d is also known as rh factor so it means blood group are decided because of the presence of three types of antigen that is antigen a antigen b and antigen d this antigen d decides the positive and the negative uh, response of that blood group so blood group let's have a look on the table that will help you to understand the uh, abilities of the different persons having the different or various types of the blood group the column first is for the blood group type second column is for the antigen present on the rbc surface third column is for the antibody in the blood serum fourth column is the um, person can donate the blood to and the last column the person can receive the blood from so let's see the first about the a positive the person will have a positive blood group hence because that are the person uh, the person's rbc will contain the antigen a on its rbc surface and antibody b in its blood serum so because of the antigen a and on the rbc surface and the antibody b in the blood serum that person is a that person is having blood group a and this positive sign shows the presence of the rh factor on its rbc surface hence it is r h positive hence a positive is written there so this a positive person which is having the antigen um, a on the rbc surface and the antibody b in the blood serum can donate his blood to the person having the blood group a positive and a b positive while this person uh, can receive the blood from the persons having the a positive blood group a negative blood group o positive blood group and o negative blood group this is about the person having the a positive blood group let's see the next the person having the o positive blood group if the person is having o positive blood group it means there is no antigen there are no antigen on the rbc surface antigen is none there no antigen are there but antibodies will be there both type of antibody antibody a and antibody b will be there on the in the serum of that uh, person it means o blood group o person will not have any antigen on the rbc surface but it will have both type of antibody in the blood serum and positive sign shows the presence of rh factor on the uh, uh, surface of their uh, rbc so it is o positive the o positive person can donate the blood to all type of the person having the all type of the blood group o positive person can give the blood to the o positive the person having the a positive the person having the b positive and a b positive it means to all that's why o blood group person is known as universal donor while this person can receive the blood from the person having the o positive blood group and the o negative blood group so o positive is the universal donor 
now the next one b positive b positive person shows the presence of antigen b on the surface of their rbc and antibody a in the blood serum and this positive sign shows the presence of rh factor on its rbc surface this blood group uh, this person having the blood group b can donate the blood to the person b positive and blood group ab positive and this person can receive the blood from the person having the blood group b positive b negative o positive and o negative let's see the next one next one is a person with the ab positive blood group ab positive blood group this blood group is because of the presence of both type of antigen on the rbc surface that is antigen a and antigen b while there will be an absence of antibody in their blood serum means both antibody a and b present will be present there and there will be no both antigen a and b will be there and there will be no antibody the person will have blood group a b and this positive sign shows the presence of rh factor so person with the a b positive blood group can donate the blood to the person having uh, a b positive blood group and it can that person can receive the blood from the all type of blood uh, all type of person having all type of blood groups hence a b um, person with the a b um, blood group are considered as a universal receptor or universal acceptor as it can as it can receive the blood from the all types of the person having the all types of the blood group the next in the list is uh, a negative a negative person is because uh, the person having the a negative blood group it means it shows the presence of antigen a on its rbc surface and antibody b and this negative sign shows the absence of antigen d means the absence of rh factor rh factor will not be there hence that person is a negative and this a negative person can donate the blood to the person having the a positive a negative a b positive and a b negative while this person can receive the blood from the a negative and o negative the next is o negative the blood group rare in the world the blood group a negative is there because there is no antigen on the rbc surface but both type of antibodies are there antibody a and antibody b and this negative science shows the absence of rh factor and this o negative person can donate the blood to the all person having the um, different types of uh, blood groups hence it is universal donor but it can receive the blood from the only one person whose blood group will be o negative then comes the B negative. B negative person will have the B antigen on the RBC surface and A antibody in the blood serum. And this B negative person can receive the can donate the blood to the person having the blood group B positive, B negative, AB positive, and AB negative. While this B negative person can receive the blood from the person having the b negative uh, blood group and o negative blood group while the last type of the blood group in the list is uh, the person with the ab negative blood group this ab negative blood group shows the presence of antigen a and b on the rbc surface while there will be no antibody on in the blood serum and this negative sign shows an absence of the rh factor that is antigen d which is responsible for the blood transfusion the blood group with the ab negative um, the person with the ab negative blood group can donate the blood to the ab positive person and ab negative person while this person can receive the blood from the ab negative a negative b negative and o negative so this is about